If your love affair with Dean was so extraordinary, how come it fell apart so easily? Have you asked yourself that? Because love is fucking magic. And like magic, you have to believe in it. You make an agreement, the two of you. It's unspoken, but it's there to put the other person first in every decision that you make because you know in the deepest part of your soul that that's what will make your life worth living. You want to know what love is? It's stress. It's just stress. Certain species with a vigorous stress response axis whose adrenal glands produce a high amount of cortisol those are the species that fall in love often, such as prairie voles. Sex is an act of aggression. It causes a trigger response that makes the woman being penetrated attached to the man on top of her. Basically, love is the Stockholm Syndrome gussied up. Oh, it may sound laughable, but it's biological. I don't like it, but I respect it. I have succumbed to it in the past, but I refuse to let something so ordinary define me. I am smarter than a prairie vole. I have a mind and I intend to use it. I thought perhaps you intended to use yours too. I see now I was wrong. Go back to Dean, grovel, give him a blowjob. I'm sure you'll be fine. You must be so lonely. You've spent your whole life alone with your face in a microscope. Good look at it that way. I think it's the most thrilling possible way to spend one's time. The chance that in every minute of every day you could stumble across even the smallest secret of the universe. And for a moment, that truth is known only to you. <laughs> <laughs>